Today on In the Woodyard, I'm up at my brother Ken's. We've got snow and lots of it. Here we go. What we have here is a pile of wood buried in the snow. Uh, Kenny had probably two feet of snow. Right now it's up past my knees. And yesterday we got over a foot. So he's over there plowing right now. And uh, I'm gonna take you over where the wood piles are and show you what he's got. Uh, they got a lot of snow up here. And the bad part is, is they had about three feet, then it rained, it melted down to about two feet and then froze. So you got a crusty layer that you break through on. So it's heart attack stuff when you try to walk in it. And I walked in it all day yesterday and the day before doing videos of him. And right now I've got my trailer over here. I'll show you with the truck. And he's got a lumber pack that I'm gonna take home with me, a bunch of lumber for kindling that I'm gonna take home. So he's moving snow right now so we can get at it because it got snowed on. So I'm gonna show you kind of what it looks like. Are you having fun in the snow? I am so sick of I plowing see. snow. Yeah. That looks kind of cool, don't it? That's why I did a It looks did like a it's shot. about eight feet tall. It actually, <laughs> it's pretty, I bet you it's seven, because there's four, there's over four feet of wood and it's sitting on pallets. Yeah. I pile that at 50, 52 inches. Right. And that's a lot of snow, man. Yeah, well, you had all that snow and then it we rained snow, and came down and, rain. and, it, and more snow and then more snow we, and then more snow. Yeah, there's, just keeps coming. I don't know how much we've had this year, but it's a lot. Too, way too much. I want to show uh, you guys some of the piles back there that he's got uh, that we did when Bert and Adam yeah, were up here. It's all covered. Only, that was a couple was weeks ago. Two weeks ago. Two weeks. Yeah. Two weeks ago. Tomorrow. Yeah. And it's all it's all buried. It's so. buried. Yeah, we're gonna load up some lumber packs I'm gonna take home, but I'm gonna show you how much snow he's gotten up here. And you're supposed to get another five to eight in a couple days. Well, they're so. talking another five to 10 on oh, two nice. more days on Monday, yeah. Nice, nice, because you guys need I spent more time on this tractor plowing this winter than every year I've had it. And last night I was watching uh, Brad on Firewood at the Furnace, his live stream. He said his neighbors are mowing lawn already. Green grass. Green grass. You guys live in the gravy, <laughs> banana belt. Like, well, he's almost in the banana belt, but here, this is... <laughs> this is bad, yeah. This is, just, this is just almost as bad as Mike in the 906. They get it up there, too. But, yeah, they get it bad, too. Mike gets it bad because he gets the lake effect He's snow. in the lake effect. And you're south of the lake effect snow, but we you still get right dumped on. We are right on the edge of lake effect. You go 20 miles north of here, 10 get, miles north of here, get a hammer. it's worse. Yeah, yeah. So but this is enough. Yeah, more it's than enough. enough. More than enough. And you're always ten degrees colder, and you always always have uh, snow two to three weeks before we get it, and you always have snow two to three weeks after ours is gone. So he'll you get an mowing, extra month. He'll be mowing lawn, and I'll still be plowing, plowing snow. <laughs> yeah, not no, quite. Not quite. Not quite. But almost. Sometimes we have green grass, and you guys still have snow. Well, like where these banks are, this is shaded. These will be here till almost May. Yeah. 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 Where it's shaded here, where these big banks are. That's the bad thing about piling wood on the left over here. It's shaded. Yeah, you got all these evergreens in here, so it's yeah, shaded. Yeah, the sun hardly gets it. But I'm going to take the camera back there and show the show the people's the wood that we did last weekend when we are two weeks ago when we were here, how it's all buried. So, yeah, he's got wood buried underneath all this snow back here. So this wood right over here to the right is stuff that uh, when Bert and Adam were up here with me when we got here about two weeks ago, we got all this, and that's all buried now, too. And he's got lots of wood back there buried, and there's wood back there buried, and there's wood back there buried. So you can see how much snow there is here. It's more than you need. And everything is frozen down slippery ice on the ground here because they had rain, and then that froze. So you got ice with snow on top. So well, it's then we a, had 40 degrees when, when Bert and Adam were here. Yeah. It, was, it was beautiful. It was t-shirt weather. It yeah. was 40 yeah. and sunny, and then it... Well, of course, then it melts, yeah. and now you're walking on a sheet of ice. But. Yep, that's what it is, and it's slanted, so you got that. So there's going to be a day out here, Kenny's going to fall down, he's going to be laying here yelling, I've fallen and I can't get up. Hey, okay. <laughs> story, I talked to my buddies the other day, his brother's 62 years old. He fell down, he broke his hip. He got a, he got a hip re instant hip replacement. Oh, 62 geez. years old, on the ice. Jeez. Drove himself to the emergency room. Nice. It's too cheap to call an ambulance. <laughs> So is this the wood we're going to take? Yeah, this is what we're going to dig through. So this is one of the lumber packs we got last time we were up here, and it's a lot of basswood, which is stuff Kenny really doesn't want. Yeah. But it'll be great for me for splitting up for kindling, so I'm gonna, that's why I brought my trailer. I'm going to load it up 
I and can, uh, I can get a little bit more out of here too. Yeah, I'll we can. it up to try to get it, you know. Yeah, I'll start pulling stuff out and you, know, you well, can. Get the trailer up or we'll just start firing it in there. You know? Yeah, yeah. But I'll, right. I'll plow this little bit out here on the edge so we ain't got to stand in knee deep snow. Yeah, and that's what it'll it is. It'll be a while before we get the car hauler out, I think. Yeah, it's buried in there too. I hope nobody wants to borrow it so <laughs> get your shovel. Yeah, well, you can't. That's going to be like cement. This is like concrete here because it was rained on and snowed on and packed and snowed on and rained on and packed. And yeah. Somebody wants to get some of this stuff from me. I'm like, I'm going to just tell them no. Yeah, yeah, you're at the point where you just tell them no, you can't you have any wood. On there. You know how much weight that is? Many, as many, many tons. Many, many tons. As much as the wood is underneath. Because I got, I got pallets on top of the tin, and then I threw railroad ties on top of the pallet, so it's already heavy. Yeah. And now there's about 10 tons of snow on there. Yeah. It makes nice. you want to puke if you got to <laughs> dig into that pile. <laughs> yeah, you'd rather tell the people, wait till, wait till the 4th of July. <laughs> well, I had a guy ask me the other day, he said, you, you got any wood plowed out? I'm like, oh. <laughs> You know, like that stuff there, that's ready to go. That's the stuff we cut last spring. When that's Jerry, stuff over there. Yeah, when yeah. Jerry, when you brought your altar last spring, yeah, yeah. that's the wood right there. That's dry. That's ready to rock. Yeah. There's 20 cores of it there. But I'm not digging all that out. No. That pile up there, there's 10 cores up in there. That's all dry. I'm not digging that out. This yeah. is all ready to go. There was almost 50 cores of this. Yeah. I'm not digging that out. Yeah. It so. Happened. So this wood right here comes from, there's are miscuts from... Uh, These are miscuts from the, from the sawmill. Sawmill. And this is what Kenny did over here. He's got all this that he cut up. So these are all in 16 inch well, pieces. Had, let's see, at full cords it would be... You said about 50, you said. Well, no, that's face Oh, cords. face cords. Divided by three, so what's 50 divided by three? Whatever. 16, 17, something like that. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot of pieces. Yeah. A lot of wood. I'm going to turn it into kindling. That's the plan anyway. All right, I'll back up the trailer and we'll start chucking wood. Let me make one more stab up there. Okay. Go. The wood is in the trailer. I'm gonna head down the road. When I get back, I'm gonna dump it, and then I gotta get to plowing because we got a like a foot, 16 inches. I don't know, a lot at home. So I gotta go home and do that. So gonna head home. That's it for today, here, folks. Tomorrow I'll be back woodyard doing something. See you then. Right now you're gonna go watch another video. Good night, Irene. Mm -hmm.